In Burp Suite Enterprise Edition, you can use our GraphQL API to integrate with third-party applications. For web applications that send requests to the API using client-side JavaScript, you need to whitelist the origin of these requests for cross-origin resource sharing. You will also need to whitelist your Jenkins or Team City URLs if you use our native plugins to integrate your CI CD systems and wish to use the Burp Site Driven Scan option. Once you have logged into Burp Suite Enterprise as an administrator, go to the Settings menu and choose Network. In the Allowed Origins for GraphQL API section, enter the origin on which the other application is running. Make sure that you include the URL scheme, domain name, and port. Add each entry on a new line. When you're happy with the details you have added, click Save, and then you're ready to start testing your external application. If you still run into cause-related issues, examine the origin header of the associated request and compare this to the URLs that you have in the whitelist. The origin of incoming requests refers only to the URL scheme, domain name, and port. You cannot restrict this to specific subdirectories. For more granular control, you need to deploy your application to a dedicated subdomain.